Hello, my name is Gary Cabell, faculty member at Savannah Technical College, and today what we're going to show you how to do is fabricate a whole chicken. I'm going to show you how to fabricate this into two breasts, uh, two thighs, two legs, and two wings. And I'm actually going to show you how to do a, a supreme cut of airline or a supreme cut in an airline chicken breast. First thing we need to do is we need to separate the, the skin from the, th from the thigh and the, and the breast. I'm going to use a bony knife. I'm going to look for that natural separation within the thigh and breast. I'm going to go ahead and score the skin on both sides. This will ensure that you have a nice uh, skin over the laying over the top of your chicken breast. Next step, we're going to separate our, our breast from the carcass. What you're going to do is you're going to look for the keel bone right down the center, and you're going to go on either side of it. You're going to use your bony knife to, to go right down to the, to the rib cage. And by doing that, you're going to be able to get all the meat. You're not going to have any wasted meat on the, on the carcass. we're going to do now, you're going to take off the, the breast and the wing all in one uh, fail swoop. You're going to look for the joint that's found right next to the, the carcass. You're going to go right through there. Now we're going to go ahead and take off the thighs and legs from the carcass. What you're going to do is you're going to look for the backbone. You're going to actually pop the joints out of the carcass for the thighs and you're going to come into the side. And just remove this from the carcass, like so. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and make what's called what's known as an airline chicken breast. This, this breast is skin on and it has the small wing bone that's been Frenched on the, on the top of the airline breast. So what we're going to do is we're going to look at the look at the wing joint. You have the tip, you have the center section, and you have the little drumette. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this about three quarters of the way uh, closest to the, the actual breast, we're going to score around the bone. So with your bony knife, you're going to go ahead and take away the skin and the meat and make sure your bone is nice and clean. So what we're going to do now is we're actually going to look at the way the joint naturally moves, which is this way, and we're going to take that against the joint, which is going to help to expose the, the top of the, of the bone. It's going to be nice and clean. We don't have to do any more to the, to the wing. Next, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and take the tenderloin off. Set that aside. We're going to come back and make sure that if there's any deposits of, of fat left on the breast, we're going to go ahead and clean those off. Here we have a properly airline chicken breast. Next, I'm going to show you how to, pr how to produce or fabricate a, a chicken supreme. Chicken supreme is a boneless, skinless chicken breast, just like you would buy in your normal, everyday grocery store. So what you'd want to do first is take off the wing completely. Chicken tenderloin comes off. Lay that on the side, and all you have to do for this is just to take off the, the chicken skin. Next we move on to our legs and thighs. Now our legs and thighs are, are actually connected right now. But what you want to do is you actually want to separate these and what you're going to look for is there's a fat line. There's a fat line which runs right here and that fat is actually uh, surrounding all the connective tissue holding those joints together. Because whenever we're actually fabricating meat and you know chicken and things like this we actually want to go through the joint and not through the bone. Because if we go through the bone, this, this knife is not made to do that. So what you want to do is you want to look for that fat line and you want to go on the leg side of that fat line. Fat line. And you go right through it. So for this to finish up our, our leg, all we want to do is sc scrape away the excess fat. and make a cut to trim up our, our 
skin. Now to, to finish or complete our thigh, what I'd like to do is go ahead and scrape away the excess fat here as well. I'm going to make sure I have enough skin to cover that thigh. To where it'll wrap, wrap around neatly. And then that is complete. Now whenever we're, we can actually put this chicken back together, so what, we'd, what we would do in that case, you would have your, your two legs, your thighs, two tenderloins, and up top, your wings, and up top is your rib cage, which is your carcass, which is what we're going to make their stock out of. And that's how you properly fabricate a chicken.